tails. Let me introduce myself. My name is Peter Kenny, a talented writer and performer of monologues. Obviously, I'm not being Peter Kenny right now. It's just something I can do when I'm in the mood. And frankly, I'm not in the mood. You see a little of that Peter Kenny goes a long way. So if you're being Peter Kenny, you better do it judiciously. And don't be thinking that I'm an actor. Actors are dogs. Ring a bell and they'll drool for you. Tell them to play dead and they'll roll over. Don't get me started about actors. Instead, I'm contemplating my career as a thief. Yes, for despite my honest face, which I think you'll agree um, handsomely repays the money lavished on it, I'm a thief. And a thief of the worst sort. But I've got my morals. I firmly believe, for example, that one should only rob friends and close acquaintances. In short, your mates. It's more honest that way. You know, I like you. You've got potential. And I think I owe it to you to disclose my speciality. I steal people's personalities. There, I've said it. I steal the parts of people that make them who they are. Sometimes I think about the first Peter Kenny. How bitterly he moaned about being replaced when I was hurting him. Like all of them, he was incapable of understanding logic. He never realised that now I was him, only a new improved version. That there was no need for that old school, retro, pathetic Peter Kenny anymore. What Peter Kenny failed to see was that I was doing it for his own good. I spot someone with a modicum of promise and I perfect them. I'm an artist. Everyone wants to be improved. It's my calling and I do it with flair. But I'm bored of this Peter Kenny stuff now. As for the first Peter Kenny, I'm going to end him. <laughs> he doesn't seem to like it down there where I keep him. I'm the real Peter Kenny. 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 Tales. Ever heard of a Roman god called Janus? He was the god of doorways and he had two faces, inwards, outwards. I like him. I like him a lot. Anyway, where was I? Um, oh yes, I was going downstairs to do Peter Kenny. But then I got distracted. Don't think I wouldn't have done him if I hadn't been distracted. I wouldn't have thought twice about doing Peter Kenny. I mean, he asked for it. And you can have a belly full of his constant whining. I keep him down there in chains, of course. It's so psychological, isn't it? In his own way, he's quite imaginative. And it's good to give him some source material, give his phobia something to gnaw at. 
No. Where was I? I'm being distracted. That's right. By a mirror. Don't be thinking that I enjoy looking at mirrors. I mean, look at me. Even as the new, improved Peter Kenny, there's nothing to write home about. I'm not sure which part of the Peter Kenny is most annoying. You know, I guess it would have to be his face. Peter Kenny has an annoying face. And don't you go siding with Peter Kenny. He deserves everything he's going to get. So there I was, standing by the mirror, looking at Peter Kenny's annoying face and wondering what on earth could be done to improve it. Van Gogh. That's what I was thinking. I mean, lopping off bits of Peter Kenny might be quite fun. The idea that there is less of Peter Kenny, that there is less annoying, might be quite a good idea. <laughs>